zoom in and then go out. Uh, That's so cool. All right, like that? Yeah. Just. You can walk. I, it's right there on the column. I can see it on the column. But they said you should use your hands, kind of like a control, like a mouse, to be able to click on it. Yes. Move. Pinch hand and pivot along. Just slide this on. Use it almost like a welding hood, but just for uh, quality control check for layout. I mean, I'm constantly measuring with the model on my iPad. Coordination would be the main main phase that would help for us. This is exactly what I'm seeing in the office, but you can actually get real life, which is great for a lot of uh, remodels, especially hospitals. Because a lot of times there, we can't even see what's already been built. So being able to walk through with what we do versus what they already have would be great. Well, obviously on the blueprint, you don't have 3D, so there's you can't see layers on it. You can only see like an overhead looking down. And there's usually a lot of lines running above or below each other, which you know the general area where it's supposed to be, but you don't have an idea of elevation. The best one I can see is definitely for remodels, where we don't know what's already there. So then we could use this to really get an idea of how we need to coordinate around what's already there. Yeah, so we got a duck squeeze in between those two. Very 